Hey, 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 hey. What's up, my beautiful people? Hope you shine it bright, not letting anybody dim that light. My name is Trinity, and welcome to my channel, All About the Healing. All right, gotta go. We have 15 minutes, so the count is going on. So, one, 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 to my ride and dies, my new subscribers, my energy exchange, 10, 20, 100, roll right back at you. Flip side, can't stop, won't stop, ain't gonna stop, nothing up in here. It is so, so be it, and I shake. All right, so we are honoring the sign of fire. Bam! There it is. Sagittarius, there it is, Leo, there it is, Aries, bam, all right, so, um, we just gonna go ahead and get into it, but, just wanna say that, um, I really am gonna do them like this, fire, water, earth, air, you need your guys need to go and support those readings because collectively as a whole they're going to be better readings than when i separate them like that it's better collectively because you're getting more energy and it's more it's more um powerful as when it's uh fire because it's all the same energy anyway on my channel right so anyway so support the chat, uh, support the fire in uh, the these readings. All right, let's get into it because I don't have a lot of time. All righty then, your overall energy is universe. Universe is your partner. It's in the hand. So this is the hand. This is the hand of God, right? And this is so powerful fire signs now this could be for fire signs this could be for cross watcher this could be for anybody to have fire in a chart this could be for anybody to click on this reading because like i said these are co really collective readings so anybody could click on any of my readings and get in it resonate or they get something out of it um but this is the hand of god it is 31 which breaks down to a four which is stability right being stable being grounded have god has your back right um where are you going god has a hand in it what you doing god has a hand in it um every um your journey where you walking where you who you got in your life what people are doing to you behind your back what people are doing um good in your life uh you know god is seeing that as well but this message right here, this energy right here is that you need to understand that you have the hand of God upon your life. A lot of you get the message, I'm a badass, get the message that I'm anointed, I'm appointed, but you really don't understand what goes along with that. With this hand of God that you have on your life, it's a responsibility. See, people want to fight you. People want to kill you. People want to destroy you because you got the hand of God on your life. People want to take from you. People want to manipulate you. People want to play games, run game on you. All because of this hand. The ultimate hand. The one and only hand that you have on your life. See, this is going to be more than 50. I'm going to try to fit this in <laughs> to be 15 minutes. Spirit, please don't, don't, don't let me run. Please just help me just 15 minutes because these things take so long, guys, to download. Anyway, the hand. This hand that you have on upon your life, a lot of some of you, I'm talking to some of you who is really going through you're a chosen one you and you have transformed you have renewed but i keep telling you guys over and over and over again you ever evolving 
It's not one transformation. It's many transformation. You're ever evolving. You're not going to stay the same. So with transformation, you got to go through something. You got to go through something to transform. It's not going to be easy. It's not an easy road. And yeah, you'll get breaks. Yeah, you'll get time where you're, you know, you're, you, you don't have, you you know, you good and you're able to, you know, not be going through something. But whatever you're going through is for a purpose and a reason. It's something that you need to do so you can grow. It's something, it's a reason for it. Those of you that have a hand, that has the hand of God on your life, you need to understand that you're not going to fit in. You're not getting ready to fit in with people. People not going to like you. They didn't like God. They didn't like Jesus. People pretend like they love God. People pretend like God is in control and God, those are just words that spew off somebody's mouth. But do you have a connection with God? Do you do you have a dialogue with God? And to even be to even go even further, you don't have to be having a long hour 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 uh conversations with God. God know your God knows your heart. You ain't got to have it ain't got to be long and drawn out and you know, all this. You ain't got to do all that. All you got to do is connect with a sincere heart. What you say out your mouth, you mean it. I love you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you for blessing me. Thank you for watching me. Thank you for protecting me. Thank you for what you do for me. Sincerely thank God. Sincerely thank your ancestors. Sincerely thank the angels. Sincerely thank your angelic team. It goes a long way. Fake, phony, and, and, and pretending. They know that mess. They know when you open up your mouth, you phony and fake. So, this hand that you have. You need to understand that your life is set apart. It's not like everybody else's life. And you're going to have to go through some things. Because the hand of God, you have to pay a price to have that hand on your life. Many people don't have the hand. So yes, this could very well be the ones that's chosen that has the hand. But... This, this, could, this could also mean something else. It doesn't have to, everything doesn't have to be about somebody that's chosen. You may was, they may be chosen to do a certain thing, but you may have the hand of God. You may have earned to have the hand of God upon your life because your heart, your soul, your very being loves God, connects to God. So you can get the hand of God that way. You don't have to be chosen to get the hand of God. It could be earned. It could be through sincerity, love, and commitment that you can have God, the hand of God on your life. But anyway, any shape, form, or fashion, which way you want to see it or say it or do it, the hand of God on your life, many people look and envy and jealous of that. However, always remember that with that hand becomes a price. You have to pay a price to have that hand on your life, right? It's not easy. It's not what people think it is. But it's everything. It's everything to have the hand of God on your life. I'm speaking to those people who don't realize. They know they have a deep connection with God, but they're trying to figure out why God don't bless them or why God don't do what they ask or why when they pray, they... because it ain't time yet. It's time to grow. It's time to grow in those areas that you need to grow. God knows what's best. 
God knows what's in your heart. God knows what you need. God knows where to set, how to teach you, to lead and guide you to the path to get you where you need to be. So if uh, your prayers have not been answered, if, if something, if you're going through and you're having a hard time and you're trying to figure out why God, it's a reason why. You got the hand. You got it. You got God's attention. It's something special. It's something about you that God is wanting to. He got the hand on you because he wants to grow. He wants you to grow and mature. He wants he wants uh, for you to be successful in whatever it is that you have uh, that you're doing on your path. It's something great. But yes, it's hard. Yes, it's a lonely road. It may be a lonely road, but you're never alone. No, you can't be in and out of people's bedrooms. And you can't be out sloppy drunk every day. You can't do the things everybody else do. But you still can go out. You can have a drink. You can have a glass of wine. You can go out. Now, I ain't going to be in on the sex because it's too much. It's too much. It's too much up in that. You get tripped up and set back for a while messing around with that sex. However, uh, I ain't even going to go there. Mm -mm. I only got a few minutes and I'm not going to go there. But what I will say is this. The hand of God is very important. I haven't even got to the rest of the cards. So, uh, avoidance. Okay. Not yet. Judication. This judication with the hand of God is someone has the hand of God upon their life. You have another individual that has come in that have done, uh, you know, now it's time for justice. See, because when somebody has the hand of God on their life, that means the people, places, and things that done things to them, they done things that done things to you, that means they have done things to God. Because you have had whatever you were trying to do, whatever they were stealing, whatever they was manipulating, whatever they was trying to do, it was concerning something God told you to do, or concerning God had leading God and directing your path and this person was trying to destroy it trying to block you, stop you trying to come at you and they thinking they're coming at you but really the things that they accumulated was written down by God they name everything they was doing and they're going to be judged, this person is trying to avoid, now they know they know now that you got the hand of God they know that you have a connection. You're deeply connected and rooted. They know now. So they're trying to avoid this judication. They're trying to, they're trying to avoid this judgment. So you have someone, the nutshell here. You have, the, not the, the real deal here is that you guys need to understand that this is you. A lot of you just think that you, you know, transform, renewed, and, you know, all hell breaking loose and all these people is coming at you and, you know, you don't, they targeting you and you got to hide and they doing all this black magic, you know, but you got the hand of God on you. That's really what this is about. They, these people is mad. These people is mad. These people are sad. These people are hurt. These people are bewildered, confused, trying to figure out what, the, how, the, how did you become, how did you become blessed? How did you become this person that had the hand of God? The universe looking at you. Who are you? How did you get this? Trying to avoid. Now that they understand that this is happening, these people are trying to avoid. This is the new situation here. They're trying to avoid any type of... Uh, they're trying to distance themselves and avoid any type of judgment. They're trying to... Uh, uh, in the spiritual realm, they're trying to fix it and trying to, to uh, you know, get it dependent on somebody else or try to cloak themselves and be in secret. And you can't cloak yourself from God. 
How are you going to cloak yourself from God? God knows all. I don't understand. They taking their chances. See, when people do stuff like that, they take their chances. They don't, it's really no, it's not really no God. Ain't God ain't going to really do nothing. I do what I want to do. God ain't going to do nothing. But then when stuff start happening to them, this person here, this person here is elevated and this person here is being judged. Then they kind of like try to figure things out. Trying to, you know, figure it out. Right? Just know, for the most part, this is what this message is about. If you're going through a hard time, if you're going through something, and you know you've been praying, you've been going on, and it's been an ongoing thing, and you're struggling with your relationship with God, just know you are going through the process. It's a process. You got to grow. This is, you got the hand of God, the Almighty, and the people that's stalking you and running you down and playing games and manipulating and trying to comp compete with you. It's all because of this. They know now that you got the hand. Do you know? Do you really know? The reason why. Because this is the reason. Those that have the hand of God on their life. Struggle. It's not going to be easy. But once you go through the process. It's just going to be a beautiful thing. People are trying to hurt you. Target you. Stalk you. And you really don't know the reason why. They won't leave you alone. Because they don't understand how you got this. All right, your spiritual message is arrow. Right, surround yourself with protective energy. <laughs> You're already surrounded. It just confirms everything around you is protected. You are protected. If you knew the devils and the levels of the things that was coming at you, you would be astounded. You would be, your mind would be blown. But you are protected on all levels. And devils, you are protected. Everybody don't get that. They trying to figure out why. And they going to ride you and ride you and ride you and ride you until they get some type of understanding of how in the world that you get this. How in the world the, the universe, God, have the hands on you? What is it about you? What do you got? And until you understand that, and until you acknowledge, you're going to have a hard time and a struggle. You've got to see your life and see what it is. You've got to see it. You've got to own up to it. Stop running. Stop running. What are you running for? Stop acknowledging and seeing the truth about your relationship, your life, your journey. It ain't going nowhere. And if you want things to get better, you're going to have to start looking at the truth and start with this hand. It's not to pump you up. It's not to pry you. It's nothing to be scared about. It is what it is. All right. Got to go. I gave y'all extra. Hope you 15 minutes. Gave you extra. All right. Hit the comments. Hit the emojis. Thumbs up. Thumbs down. Just thumbs the channel. Share, share, share. Subscribe. You know what to do. Um, uh, description box. No personal readings. The description box have all the information there. Social media. Hit the notification bells. Uh, so you can always know what's up, know what's up with the channel. Sending love. Sending healing your way. Trinity is out.